All right, so here we are. We're doing the Haimakua tour hike, which is super cool. We're gonna be going up all these ladders, climbing up to the top of this cliff <laughs> and uh, getting some awesome views from up top. So here we go. We already went up the first flight of ladders. Now we're going up some wooden stairs. And there's another set of ladders coming. And this hike really gets you out of breath quickly. Like we keep on having to like go up, take a breather, go up, take a breather. But we got an amazing view while we're taking our breathers. And the hill is covered in wildflowers at this time of year. It is July 5th. And look at flower, yellow flowers, daisies, and the view. Damn! <laughs> okay, we made it up the first step, set of ladders and there's chains and there's ropes. And now we have this amazing view and we're walking along the cliff edge. There's Renee. frequently taking my breath away <laughs> more so than a lot of other hikes that I did and I'm in pretty good shape right now and I think it's because the inclines are so steep it's not all gradual or graded it's just like they basically made this sheep path <laughs> into a hiking path there's still a whole bunch of sheep up here show, show them the ground but yep here's where we're walking But we got amazing views on the way up, so we're just taking lots of lots of breathers. You take like 20 meters and you breathe. <laughs> take 20 meters and you breathe. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's incredible up here, and we've literally seen zero hikers aside from us. So so far we've done this hike all by ourselves. We've had this whole place for ourselves. I think we're about to crest the top of the ridge. Let's see. We made it to, I think this is like the main point. There's this like little station where you get to sign a book to prove that you've made it to the top. You're one of the select few. <laughs> so we're gonna sign the book, find a little snack spot and eat some sandwiches. <laughs> Yay! Guest book. <laughs> <laughs> All right, check out this 360 incredibleness. Oh my gosh, every direction you look, it is incredible. <laughs>
Hold up that easy cheese. Easy cheese. <laughs> Renee hiked all the way to the top of this Heiko Militar mountain with easy cheese <laughs> so we can have delicious snacks up on the top of the mountain. <laughs> easy cheese. I love this pretty little easy cheese. <laughs> All right, we're coming down the hike now, and going down is awesome because you get the views the whole way down. So, look at that. It's incredible. And uh, we got amazing views all the way to the bottom, and you don't have to stop and take so many breaks. It is pretty steep, so you just kind of like let gravity take you down the hill, and uh, you get this beautiful view. Okay, so on this hike there are uh, chain holds uh, for some really steep spots. Today's a really nice, uh, non-windy, warm, sunny day. So um, unless you're like not very sure of your footing, you probably don't even need these chain holds. But I could see it on a really windy or blustery day if it was raining, you'd really want those for a little peace of mind. Um, so just be aware of that. There you go. Okay, we just finished up the Heimala Couture hike. Uh, it's only about 45 minutes to go up, half hour to go down, and um, there's some incredible views up there. There's a little bit of scrambling. Um, make sure you bring some snacks for when you're on the top, and if you're afraid of heights, this might not be the hike for you because <laughs> there's a lot of scrambling, holding ladders, holding ropes, holding chains, and a little bit of navigation.